How's it going guys? It's me Simon, this is my walkthrough for the Castle Map Fright stage in Luigi's Mansion 3 and how to beat the King Ghost, so let's begin. So we're on the 6th floor of Luigi's Mansion, the Castle Map Fright Suite, let's head on in. To gain access to the castle we need to bring up Guizzi, right click the analog stick and he'll come out and then walk through that gate. Head to the left hand side, there's a pulley system over there, if you hoover that up and pull it'll gain us access and pull open the door. And then right click your analog stick to change to Luigi and then walk on through, we're in. Double click and Luigi will go back into the hoover. So let's walk through the, this hallway and then we get access to the main stadium of the castle. If we walk to the edge we access the cutscene and we meet the king ghost. Night map right. He gets his royal trumpets. Doo -doo -doo -doo. And there he is. Uh, and he's showing off he's got the elevator button that we want. He's like, come and get it. So let's head on through to the left hand side door and we're met with two ghosts sword fighting. They're just like normal ghosts, so just hoover them up, slam them, and then we've got access to the next area. There's a nice and simple puzzle in the next part. So just head all the way down to the stairs. There is a chest there if you want to get it yourselves, but I'm just gonna do this quickly to get you through the walkthrough. Run to the bottom. If you stand on this part, the spikes come up. So right click your analog stick, bring up GUIG, hoover up the pulley system so he pulls down the spikes, change to Luigi, and then walk on through. Here we've got two normal ghosts and two gold ghosts that we're gonna fight. They've got shields, so you can shoot him with a plunger to knock the shield out of his hand, flash him with the torch, hoover him up, and slam him. There's a gold ghost coming up as well. So you can use the gold ghost and slam him into the one with the shield to knock the shield out of his hand. That also works. So hoover him up, and there. You must complete this bit before you can get access to the key which is hidden in the middle barrel. So once you've taken them out, as I said, the shield, the key is hidden in the middle barrel. Shoot the plunger, hoover that, pull and press A to reel the key. Pick up the key and we continue on. So in this room, we're gonna bring out our good old friend Guiji again to avoid the spikes. Hoover and pull the police and it reveals three different police on chains we need the bottom left hand side one so go there hoover it pull and it reveals a trapdoor now we need to get through the spider web so if we flash the torch at the green flashing button the furnace will light up hoover up our torch light up the torch and burn our way through and now we can walk over to the other side where there's a police Take some money, hoover up, and pull the pulley to reveal some ladders to climb up. Or just one ladder. <laughs> climb up, and then we've got access to the next room. In this room, we're going to need Guiji again. So right click, bring up Guiji. And this time, we're going to hoover the windmill to bring up the elevator. Change to Luigi, put him in the elevator, and then hoover the opposite direction to send Luigi down. So this bit, there is a secret door. What we need to do is use X and the dark light against this wall. Hold it to reveal a secret door and out fly some orbs. So now we've got hoover up all these orbs before we can have access to the door. Pretty simple. And let's go on through. And now there's some hooded guys shooting arrows. What we need to do is let's use Luigi first, hoover up this side's police system. 
and the roof above them starts to collapse. So now change to Guiji. And on the other side, there's another pulley. Hoover it. Put it down. And boom. The coast is clear for Luigi. And he can walk through water because Guiji's weakness is water. And we can pick up a key and we've got loads of money so we're rich. So now we've got the key, let's head on back into the other room. Let's go through this lion shaped tomb thing. And we spun through and now the windmill thing goes crazy. And the elevator is going to start falling down and reveals loads of hammerhead ghosts. You just defeat them normally, there's just loads of them, so they're just gonna run around like crazy. Flash them with the light, like this, and just hoover them up. So once you've defeated them, we can go and carry on and go through this door on the left. And here... You don't have to do this bit with the fish, this was just me messing around. So here... You bring up Guiji, go over to the pulley, drag it to open the door, change to Luigi, he can go through into the prison and pick up the key, but it's not that simple because it was a trap. The ghost comes out, splashes Guiji, and inside there's spikes cl closing in on Luigi. So bring up Guiji, now we've got to beat the ghost and try and save Luigi. So they're just like normal ghosts, just flash them with the light, hoover them and slam them each, in each other to speed up the process. Because we are against time, otherwise Luigi would just get squashed by these spikes. So go over, once you've defeated them and lift up the gate and quickly change to Luigi. Make sure he's got the key, otherwise he'll be squashed and you won't have the key. Okay, so let's go through. So for this part, we need to pull this bit with Guiji, change to Luigi, and there's another windmill thing. We need to move them so that they're in this direction, one at the top and one at the bottom, and then you'll be able to combine them in the middle. But then you've got run through without getting hit by axe. And as you see, I got hit by the axe. Hopefully you don't get hit by the axe. Yeah. And then we just run on through. And now we've got some more hooded arrow shooters here. Bring out Guiji. Head to the other side. Use the dark light on these four wheels to reveal a secret cart. But we got to hoover up these orbs, of course. Now we're gonna hoover the cart into the middle. So it blocks those hooded guys from shooting Luigi so he can make his way through that side. And then there's an apple cart on the other side. We're going to bring that into the middle as well. So now hoover up the apple cart on the other side to block these guys from shooting more arrows. And Luigi's path is now clear. Let's head our way to the door. A few more ghosts will show up but they're just like normal ghosts so you just flash them with the torch and hoover them up. And now we're actually on our way to the boss battle. But in the next part, there's an Indiana Jones kind of thing come, happening. Some Hellblades will slash across. So watch out for those. Just like that. So we need as much HP as we can have for this boss battle, of course. So watch out for those blades and then just head on through. And we're in the main arena, ready for the boss battle. So here we go. Night Mac Fright is up there, the King Ghost. He hasn't spotted you yet, but now he notices you're here. He's getting ready to fight, he's angry. He's gonna get into his armor. He's got his joust and his shield. And you notice that he's got this target on his chest. That's what we're gonna aim for later on. So to beat the King Ghost, what you need to do is charge up your torch when he's gonna run at you. Hit, flash, and then shoot a plunger at his chest, hoover it up and slam him to break his armor. 
You need to do this about three times. So get ready here, ride right around. When he gets ready to joust, he does this run up thing. So he lifts up his joust. Watch out for those arrows. And he does this run up thing. So make sure you've had your torch charged. Sh flash. Shoot the plunger. Hoover it up and slam him to break his armor. And one last time. And once you've completely broken his armor, it's you versus him as a ghost. So he's got this spinning attack. So you need to dodge this spinning attack. It's coming up right now. So run out of the way. He gets dizzy and now you can flash him with your torch, hoover him up and slam him. So watch out for the spinning attack. Run out of the way. He's dizzy and this should do it. Hoover him up. Slam him. And there you go, that's how you beat Night Mac Fright the Ghost King. So guys, if you enjoyed this video, check out some of my other videos to help support my channel and consider subscribing for more content like this. Thank you for watching. I'm Simon from LOG Level 1 Gamer. Until next time, peace out.